guys welcome back to leo's animal planet my friend alex asked me to make a video about peregrine falcon so i'm gonna make one here just for you today i saw um the most amazing creature in action it was a peregrine falcon after school i went to churchyard park in london and i saw peregrine falcons and i know they're really rare and it's really hard to find them but i saw them in churchyard park well, most amazing creatures can be around you in london if you just look close or any city you see and live in and they're in the middle of london like peregrine falcons as you can see of course well, baby peregrine falcons needing food so the parents went hunting for pigeons and they got some pigeons and the babies ate it also the peregrine falcons did they were screaming like crazy they were like at the top of the church and we could still hear them it was so weird but we did they needed so much food because the mum and because they're growing and like the mum and dad need to get five things for them to eat in one day. Peregrine falcons are the fastest creature on the planet and they can go up to 321 kilometers per hour hour and when they're not diving well they go 321 kilometers per hour with the dive but like um you know what I mean. and, and like when they're flying they probably just saw like 56 kilometers per hour maybe a bit more like 70 70 something peregrine falcons have excellent binocular vision that's better than uh, that's eight times more powerful than humans. When peregrine falcons dive, their nostrils can close automatically like this, like a robot. If they had nostrils, which I don't think will probably happen, but it will happen someday. And their beak shuts like this. So that the oxygen, all of that oxygen will stop, won't hurt the body and so its tummy won't explode or something. Uh, so they do that so they survive and it's really cool. Did you know Peregrine Falcons actually inspired scientists the nostrils helped inspire scientists to make the jets that we have now today peregrine falcons have inspired like writers and comic books writers of movies like falcon falcon in marvel it became marvel is one of the most famous things in well the universe and look they used a peregrine falcon or just any type of falcon to make one character peregrine falcons have super sharp talons like their talons are like probably like so sharp it's like as sharp as a probably even sharper than a needle or a pin probably even sharper than a needle or a pin yeah i gotta be honest they look so sharp this is when some peregrine falcons die because you know on the pavement they put like this thing called pesticides it is a poison to kill like rats and stuff if they eat it and you know peregrine falcons they eat rats and the rat could have pesticides in their body so the peregrine falcon eats it and then the peregrine falcon gets poisoned, unfortunately. If you want to help the birds, if they're like your favorite species of animals or something, just donate money to the RSPB. It stands for Royal Society of the Protection of Birds. And the RSPB 
built like boxes and nests to help these wonderful birds. And it's pretty hard to do that, right? And you can help the peregrine falcons and all the other birds. And by the way, if you want to see them and you live in London, bring binoculars if you want to see them. Because like, I saw about five or six, maybe even ten. I heard them scream ten times. Just, it's really cool. Just stay there and it will be really cool. It was in Camberwell too, so if you live near Camberwell, just try and go to Camberwell Churchyard Park next to the spire of on top of the gargoyles and it might not be there anymore but just in case try look there okay see you soon bye bye